Child exploitation investigators say they are working harder than ever before here in Maine and around the country. The National Center for Missing and Exploited Children fielded more than 29 million tips last year. The Maine State Police Computer Crimes Lab is constantly getting reports from the National Center and has received more than 600 so far this year. New Center Maine's David Guildford got an inside look at this unit, which has been put into the spotlight this spring. The, uh, the team here at CCU is exposed to on a daily basis. Um, I really don't have the words to, to, to describe that. In a brick fortress in Vassalboro, Sergeant Tom Pickering with Maine State Police heads the 19-person computer crimes unit. Half are civilians, like these two women whose identities we've hidden. Uh, right here, they're reviewing cyber tips um, and conducting those initial review and investigations. They use supercomputers to process data, toolkits to break open laptops and hard drives, and what's called a Faraday box, which blocks signals to devices placed inside, so a suspect can't remotely delete data from their confiscated phone. The tools are sci-fi. The work, excruciating. These are images and videos of children being uh, assaulted, so uh, that's extremely difficult. They're busier than ever. After fielding more than 1,200 reports last year, they've already received 600 by the first week of April. This spike in call volume is unprecedented. Where in the world is this child being harmed? Last month, we spoke with Yoda Soros from the National Center for Missing and Exploited Children. And our goal there is to make sure that we can then push that report and make it available to law enforcement. The National Center constantly brings reports to Maine State Police. The two organizations helped produce the Elliot Cutler arrest in March. But when their work leads to an arrest or conviction, Pickering's team doesn't rest. We're constantly moving on to the next one. No time to, to celebrate victory. No, um, everyone here is pretty humble. It's not a, it's not something that we celebrate. The work never stops inside their fortress. David Guilford, New Center, Maine. And the Maine Computer Crimes Unit is hiring. If you're interested, there's a link to apply on the state police website.